with a big smile on my face. And hey everybody, this is Allie from Allie's Bookshelf. And it's time to film my IMM for this week. Um, I had a halfway decent week. I actually got um, two books in the mail. One from a great friend of mine, um, Kristen from Growing Up Young Adult. Um, sent me a book that I'm borrowing from her, and I'll be telling you about that in a minute. Thank you, Kristen, so much for that. I actually um, got um, a poster and a coffee mug that I won a couple weeks ago, and I finally got it in the mail. It's of um, um, <laughs> Whirl, this book. I got the book. I got that a couple weeks ago already. And then my mug, my coffee mug. That matches the series. And then I got a poster, it's huge, of the book cover as well. Yay! So excited. Um, I got those in the mail this past week too. So I was going crazy over those. Um, I do have a cold, so I'm sorry if I sneeze in the middle of this. I'm going to try my hardest not to. Um, like I said, my friend Kristen from Growing Up Young Adult sent me the pledge. I'm really excited to read this. It's by um, Kimberly um, Durding. I hope I said that right. Ooh, not good with names. But anyway, I got this to read and review. Um, she also sent me, thank you so much, Kristen, a passport. And it's signed by Kimberly Durding. So exciting. Love it. Thank you. Um, next, I have The Dragonfly Prophecy by Jacqueline um, Castle. Um, this book is, um, about a 17-year-old girl named Lexi Blaine. She believes that she is the creator of her own destiny, but learns that she isn't the creator of her own destiny, that her destiny created her. So, I mean, it sounds like a really good book. I love the beautiful cover. Dragonflies. Really cool. Something different. I'm really excited to read it. Um, I do want to read something off the back. It sounds really cool. Um, it has been said that dragonflies are symbolic of an imminent change. Dreaming of one signifies that life is not what it appears to be. Dreaming of a swarm don donates dark stains of guilt on your soul. Dreaming of ingesting one means that one is devoured with a passion that needs to break free to the surface. I ignored the dragonflies that haunted my dreams. Sounds so good to read. Cannot wait. Next, I am actually going to be doing the 2012 Young Adult Contemporary Challenge of Katie, uh, Katie's Book Blog and Reading Angel. I'm really excited to do that because it um, Young Adult Contemporary isn't usually what I read, so I'm going to break into something different than what I usually read. So I went ahead and got me two books today at Walmart that is Young Adult Contemporary, and I figured I'd start with these and get these read before I start that. That way, I can already go ahead and break into it. And know what I'm in store for. So I got Sarah. Um, I think it's it's not it's Dessen. I'm hoping I said that right. Um, but it's Sarah Dessen. Along for the ride. Love the beautiful covers of her books. The second one is also by her. Um, it's called What Happened to Goodbye. Love the covers. So beautiful. So yes, that is what I got in my mailbox this week. What did you get in your mailbox? I'd love to know. Seriously, you can comment, link me, do whatever you'd like. Um, I also wanted to say I am going to be doing a giveaway for I've been for wherever you go. I have an extra art copy, and I would love to give this to somebody. Um, I will link the form into the giveaway um, post here in just a couple of minutes. Um, make sure you sign up to win this. It's a beautiful book. Cannot wait to read it. I actually not ready yet. <laughs> Um, also, a blog. I have a blog tour in a couple weeks for the book Recession Proof. Make sure you hang out and stick around for that as well. It's by Kimberly S. Lynn. I'm reading it right now, actually. Probably going to finish it tonight or tomorrow. Really exciting stuff going on here soon. Um, so, I hope you all had a good week last week and have a great week this week. Bye. Happy reading.